We're here joined by Luke Humphries. Luke, you've just played in your first Premier League experience. What did that feel like to step out there? Oh, it felt great. You know, it was. It felt uh, something I, I know I played in the world, but it just, it's just something special about the Premier League. You know, the crowd is just so loud, and we're only in a four or five thousand pound ar uh, thousand person arena, so I can't imagine what the ten, twelve thousand people want to like. But honestly, that was. It felt much better than the world. You know, it just felt amazing. My first hundred average on the TV and. And it wasn't just about the average, you know, I just enjoyed every moment of that and it was some great finishes and, and yeah, I, I loved every minute of that. I was going to ask you, where did that performance come from? Because if you're in admissions, you haven't hit the heights so far this year. We haven't seen anything like that on the Pro Tour. Where did that come from? I mean, your, your guess is as good as mine. I, I really don't know. Well, I just have this sort of knack of walking up onto that stage and, and finding my best game, you know? I think that wasn't, well, I wouldn't say it was my best game, but... I just seem to go up on that stage and something comes out of me, you know, I'm a bit like Dimitri. He wouldn't mind me saying that, Dimitri, he comes alive up on the stage and I feel like that happened to me. I walk onto that stage and everything feels perfect and, and unfortunately on the floor it doesn't feel like that. But it's something I'm going to have to learn, you know, and, uh, and get used to and, and hopefully get better at. The 161 had that place erupted. You almost seemed to speed up as well after the first few legs. Did you, was that a conscious thing to do? I mean, the 161 really didn't need to go, I think. Gerton wasn't on a finish, but I thought he might just give me that little boost, you know, because I wasn't playing good before the, the three, four legs before that. So I thought, just give yourself a little boost and, and, and pick myself up, and it did. And sometimes I'm a bit. Um, Vincent's, Vincent Van der Waart's another one, you know, when he's playing well, he speeds up, gets quicker, and I feel that's a part of my game, actually, you know. If I'm, if I'm playing well, I'll, I'll speed up. With the performances in the world and the performance you've just put in here, are you hoping that now opens the doors for a World Series event potentially? I mean, yeah, that would be great. You know, I, it's, it's one of them things where I'm not sure if I deserve it, but I'd be happy with a pick. pick you know, um, if we're going on sort of uh, stage form, you know, I think I do deserve a pick. But if we're going on overall, you know, it's, I'm a bit in the. I'm sort of one of them people that could be picked, maybe not. But uh, if Barry or Matt, you know, give me a pick, I'll, I'll actually be over the moon and hopefully keep performing like that. Does that send you to my head in the best possible spirit and form as well? Yeah, definitely. You know, I think the only thing could have been better was taking that 148 out, which is very close. So, But yeah, it gives me a good bit of confidence, you know, going into tomorrow, I play Vincent um, in the third round of the UK Open. It could be as good as that game up there. You know, we're both very quick, very fast, and it could be a very good game. Giving a bit of advice to the other contenders that haven't played yet, if you could tell them one thing, what would it be after your experience? I mean, most of the contenders are sort of more experienced than I am, so it's hard for me to tell them something that's going to help them. But I'll just say relish the moment and, and, and enjoy it, because it's just, a, it's just one of them games where you can go out and really change your life. You know, because a lot of people who are on social media have been like, this game's nothing, you know, it's not, but it's not. It's, it really can put you in the books for a lot of other things, and it boosts your spirits up, and who's, who's to say I can't go on and do bigger things than, from a performance like that? So yeah, it's a lot, lot of things for them to, to look forward to, and. I think the next uh, five contenders can really have a good push and, and maybe get a win this time. Luke, congratulations on a great performance and thanks for joining us, mate. Thank Pleasure. you very much. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you.